Good morning, viewers. I'm Samiksha Srivastava. You're watching the Morning Express, tracking all the latest on Maharashtra political crisis. Now, getting in latest details on uh, the upheaval uh, within the Mahavikas Agadi government, we're now getting to know that the Sena MLA Dilip Lande on his way to Guwahati to join the Shinde camp. So, uh, the rebel camp only swelling uh, by uh, the day. And the latest that we are getting to know is that another Shiv Sena MLA, Dilip Lande, is en route Goahati to join the Shinde camp, where the rebel camp is put in put up in the Goahati hotel. So that's the latest coming in. We have Alicia joining us from the Shiv Sena Bhavan, Shivangi joining us from outside the Matushri, and Piyush Oi joining us from outside the Sharad Pawar residence. Let me first go across to Alicia, who's reporting live from the Shiv Sena Bhavan. Alicia, the latest what we are getting to know is that another Shiv Sena MLA is en route Goahati. Give us more details. Well, yes, we know that uh, there were three Shiv Sena MLAs and five independent MLAs. They are on their way to uh, Guwahati to join Ignash in the camp. But now it is confirmed that it's one of the MLA, that is uh, Shiv Sena MLA Dilip Lande. Uh, two days back, we know that uh, Dilip Lande, who was present in the said during his hotel with the other Uddhav Thakre camp MLAs, and uh, it, he was also present in all the meetings. But all of a sudden, we know that uh, Dilip Lande was already reached Surat and uh, he's on his way uh, to Guwahati. He's going to join. Uh, Ignash in the camp. There are more two MLAs of Shiv Sena who is already on their way and they're going to reach uh, uh, Guwahati. Yesterday night we saw there are two independent MLAs, that is uh, MLA Kishore and uh, MLA Geeta Jain. They are the independent MLAs who has reached uh, uh, late night at the Guwahati, uh, 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 Guwahati where uh, Ignash and the other MLAs uh, they have been stationed there and they are already welcomed by them. But yes, there are more and more MLAs that has been that has already been claimed by uh, Ignash and because yesterday the letter that was very much important. We saw that the letter that was given to Deputy Speaker with the 37 because everyone was actually making a question of a magical number because uh, uh, to form a government with the BJP, the Shiv Sena, uh, specifically the Ikna Shinde camp, Ikna Shinde will need the magical number that is of 37 and finally with the uh, letter that was given to Deputy Speaker clearly stating that he has the number, uh, he has 37, in total 37 Shiv Sena MLS and that is the reason why he should be uh, reaffirm and should be appointed as the leader of uh, Shiv Sena Legislative Assembly and Bharat should be given yes. as a uh, Alicia, chief. yes. Let me so, take that uh, same point across to Shivangi as well who is reporting live from outside the Matushri. Uh, Shivangi, the latest what we are getting to know is that uh, Chief Minister Udav Thakri has also called a meet uh, this uh, afternoon with the department heads. Uh, give us more details on that. Right, Samiksha. Now we're seeing fast and hectic developments now, uh, Samiksha. And like, uh, before I go to that, of course, there's a meeting later on at 12.30 uh, in the Sena Bhavan. That will take place in the Sena Bhavan later on. Uh, but what uh, my colleague uh, uh, Alisha, you know, got us a, that exclusive scoop there, uh, Dilip Lande. Uh, remember that I was at the St. Regis Hotel where they had hoarded uh, the uh, loyalists, the Shivsena loyalists there in the hotel. and. We had spoken to Dini Pilande. I remember speaking very clearly to him and I asked him, I asked him that uh, what is the plan ahead and he said that I am, I am with Uddhav Thakre. So it's mm. coming as a very big turnaround, Samiksha, that Dini Pilande was one of those uh, uh, MLAs who was in the hotel in St. Regis, in the Shiv Sena camp, in the Uddhav Thakre camp, where he clearly told Republic TV, I am with Uddhav Thakre. So this is coming as a big surprise and uh, one more, one more loyalist in, in a sense turning into a rebel. Right now, this is Matushri uh, uh, Samiksha. Viewers, this is very important because this is uh, the residence of uh, Uddhav Thakre. He left his official residence and he has come here for the past mm. uh, two days, one and a half, two days now. He's saying that I will quit. I will quit if the MLAs, uh, that's what they want. But so far, of course, the numbers are still stacked against him and the Shinde camp is swelling. And latest, uh, what we got right on Republic TV, that one more loyalist is actually on his way, on mm -hmm. his way right now to join the Shinde camp. Yes. Shivangi, thanks for that. Stay with us. We have Piyush Shori as well joining us live from outside uh, Sharad Pawar's residence. Uh, Piyush, if you could give us uh, some details as to what is NCP's strategy at this point in time. So definitely, Shiva. Uh... Samiksha, you know, there are a lot of you know confusion of what exactly is the stand which NCP is going to take. Now, you know, there are murmurs which are there of you know a lot of NCP MLAs not being happy of uh, the part of this MBA government and you know asking Sharad Pawar 
the NCP Supremo to move out of this uh, uh, coalition, which may fall any time apart. But yesterday, we also saw Ajit Pawar saying that you know they are uh, supporting uh, Uddhav Thakre, they are behind him, and they will uh, not allow MBA uh, to fall apart. So you know there are a lot of you know uh, speculations. There are a lot of murmurs of what exactly is the stand of NCP. Uh, to make sure, you know, uh, that there are some also MLAs who are saying that they are willing to sit in the opposition. Uh, yesterday, we also saw, you know, uh, the senior uh, NCP leader, Jayant Patil, saying that if required be, they, you know, they are willing to go for floor uh, test and uh, so that the, there is a clarity of what is going on. Uh, having said that, you know, even though as of now, the rebel camp headed by Ekta Shinde may have had a lead, but the things are so fluid, things are changing so rapidly that there are also speculations that things can also move into the favour of Uddhav Thakre camp. However, yes. how unlikely it may seem. Hmm. Back to you, uh, Samiksha. All right. Piyush, Alisha and Shivangi, just stay with us. Uh, let's take a look at this report now.